Now, what are my advice in terms of uh, your career? Uh, well, primarily, I think the fundamental advice is to would-be graduates of this particular course or young architects and uh, young ones who would want to enter architecture is that you have to have the passion for it. Architecture is a profession that requires not just skills formation and training, but it requires first and foremost a passion to architecture. Not just simply a passion for building, but a passion for designing. When one has the passion, even at your most lowest moments, you are driven. It's like a hobby. You are driven to finish a particular task simply because you are interested in what you are doing. I think the mistake of a lot of people is that they enter architecture thinking that it's going to be a free passport to a very comfortable life. No. Architecture is hard work. Architecture requires a lot of sleepless nights. Architecture is a lot of blood and pain. And architecture sometimes is not forgiving. Architecture, for you to become happy, revolves around a person finding that spark of light that initiates interest and passion. As long as people are very much interested in talking about architecture, not necessarily doing architecture, but talking about architecture, and seeing architecture, and viewing architecture, and feeling architecture, then to a certain extent, you then end up becoming very passionate. When you become very passionate in what you're doing, you end up forgiving all of the difficulties that happen along the way. Because at the very end, your end desire is to see a work completed and finished. You will fight for whatever you are designing, down to the last centavo or down to the last dollar that you could squeeze out from a client simply because you are passionate for your solution. Architecture requires that kind of dedication. If there is a lack of dedication, a lack of spark, a, lot of, a lack of interest, then to a certain extent, this may not be the course for you. If you started with it, but somewhere along the way, the interest disappears, probably because of misguided information, then what you need to do now is find it. Try to bring it back. Remember, for students of architecture, you may not be fortunate enough to be given inspired instruction. But one thing that you should have is the self-admiration of building and finding that inspiration. A professor may not inspire you, but because you are inspired, no amount of poor instruction will deter you from becoming interested in the course.